Ah, uh, it's happening again. <laughs> Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the brand new Honest Reaction video. So today we're gonna be checking out a special clip by Dreamcatcher, of course, and their song with a pretty, um, I wanna say a pretty dreadful and maybe intimidating title. It's called And There Was No One Left. I don't know why, but I instantly think about something like maybe a Game of Thrones, maybe Lord of the Rings and a battle, you know, a huge battle, and maybe one of the characters is telling the story, you know, we got caught in this battle one day, the likes of which I've never seen in my life, and at the end of it, there was no one left. Something like that, I don't know why. Let me, let me know if you feel the same way. But now, I guess, let's proceed with this video. But before we jump in, as always, don't forget that on my Patreon, you can find more than 500 exclusive reactions to BTS, TWICE, Red Velvet, live stage reactions, including Dreamcatcher live performances, then K-dramas like My Mr. and Hotel Del Luna, and much more. So if you'd like to see all of that, make sure to check it out. The link to my Patreon is going to be down below. All right, so we're gonna do it the same way. No lyrics at first, and then gonna go back and check out the lyrics. Yeah, so uh, about the title again. Listen, you can make literally any situation scarier with this title. So if you just say, we entered the room and there was no one. It doesn't sound scary, right? There was no one. But if you say, we entered the room and there was no one left. It's like, it's, it implies, right? It implies that there were people there or someone, but then they disappeared for some reason. And you're like, oh, spooky. <laughs> I don't know. That's what I feel. So let's, let's go. Let's go. This is a first for me. I've heard Dami sing before. Deja Vu. Odd Eye. Maybe some more songs. But in this tone, in this range. Um, nice instrumental. I like the bass, the guitar. Yeah, sounds good. Sounds good. Ah, uh, it's happening again. <laughs> I was like, Aaron, don't smile, don't smile, don't smile, don't... No, I still smiled. She... She... I don't know, she did something... Uh, maybe she smiled in a particular way, but it, I smiled too. No, she didn't smile. <laughs> I don't know, maybe my bias found me. I don't know, I don't know. I'm... What do you think, guys? Let me know down below. <laughs> Pretty cool. That's pretty cool what they're doing here. Yeah, yeah, and how they're form and shifting and distorting their vocals to create this kind of melody. That's cool. Oh, it was Dami. Wait, hold on. What? What? I'm lost. Wait, hold on. 
Dummy, right? It's dummy, right? Jazz, bar. it's like uh, you know, it's it's somewhat similar to jazz bar. I want to say, I think primarily because of the instrumental, right? Because of real instruments there, because of the guitars. Um, but at the same time, it's very different. Mm. I like how again they th this have this contrast, right? Y using real instrumentals and then distorting the vocals in an artificial way to create the melody in the chorus. Um, uh, pretty sure Xion got major ASMR in this part. And I want to see the outtakes for this one. Dami, I, I hear you. I hear you over there. Uh-huh. Alrighty. So, English subtitles. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, did you see that? Did you catch that? Did you catch that? Did you catch the... Oh, it's... it's, it's, it's. <laughs> There's another video. What? What? I forget. What? Big... The stars... Mm -hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Following through the wind to you, and there was no one left. Oh, 
Under three minutes, unfortunately. Okay. All right, all right. So this was, uh, and there was no one left. Right. So with this one, when it comes to the meaning, I'm not sure. Maybe I shouldn't be looking for a deeper message. Maybe it's just connected to their uh, nightmare storyline, right? And they're still caught in the dream. They're trying to get out, something like that. Let me know what you think down below. Um, about the song now, about the melody. It's pleasant. It's, it's pretty easy going, I want to say, because it's simple, right? But because of that, I don't know if I'm going to keep listening to it because one thing, it's pretty short. And second, I feel like it lacks variety at places. You know, the melody is pretty much the same throughout the whole song that, you know, the distorted melody, the distorted vocals, they, they sound cool at first listen. But then for the second chorus, I guess I would prefer that they did something else, you know, for them to add something to it. But still, you know, at the same time, I can't say that I didn't like this song. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. So I think, um, yeah, if I do listen to it, it's going to be playing in the background. I think this is a very nice fitting background song. Uh, yeah, something like that. But again, it's just because of the fact that it's simple. I think it's easy to listen to. But at the same time, if you just sit down and don't do anything else and just listen to the song, it might become boring uh, if you've heard it, I don't know, 10 times already. So something like this. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you think about the song. And with this said, I'll catch you all Aaron Aderson in my next video. As always, guys, take care. Stan Talent, Stan Dreamcatcher. Keep listening to great music and love.